future. <laughs> Food courts of the future. I don't believe this. It's like a dream. This is 2041. This is 2041. Nick, you did it. You are a genius. <laughs> You've been working on this all your life. Yeah, certainly. So in effect, you could use this thing to change history. Oh, yeah, we could prevent Newt Gingrich, Jim Carrey, and the Smashing Pumpkins. <laughs> That's not why I brought you here. I want you to buy me an orange Julius. Honestly, I'm out of money. And I need more so I can continue my work now that I've made this breakthrough. So what can Jet Corps do for you? I need an R&D grant. I want to be able to continue my work. <sighs> this is big. Big and pink. This is very big. What's the use of a time machine for Jet Corps? Make an example. Uh, you could send an egg into the future. Study the long-term <laughs> effects that we're having on our environment. You could uh, you send Bob Saget to meet Charlemagne. You could figure <laughs> out a way to stop shooting at each other. You know, if you went back a hundred years in the past, and put a hundred dollars in the bank, and then came back a hundred years to the present, God, the interest alone would make you a millionaire. Yeah. Well, I'm going over to Sparrow. Anyway, these ideas are just the, just the tip of the iceberg. Listen, Nick, I'm going to go over the heads of my bosses here and take this directly to J.K. Robertson. The CEO of Gen Corp? The, the, uh, the guy that does the, the TV commercial. That's the one. Look, I will drive him up here from the city personally if I have to. Right? <laughs> that would be great. All right. It's a Radisson. I take it we're ready to go. Mm -hmm. I don't think I'll ever be ready. I'll bring you back on a tour sometime. Like oh man, here we go. I gotta get a call into Robertson. I'll walk back to the past. <laughs> and you fly through another spirograph drawing. <laughs> I left my keys at the Manchu Walk of the Future. 